Hi, welcome to 5935 Ridgebrook Lane. This is a wonderful five bedroom home located in Arendelle Heights, one of Colorado Springs' more mature established neighborhoods in northwest side of town. It's a beautiful location. We see this is set back in a large cul-de-sac. It's actually a former Parade of Homes model from 1980. Um, this neighborhood, if you're not aware of it, is kind of one of the hidden little gems here in the springs. We're gonna walk up the front to the home. And you notice from the outside, we've got a large two car garage. Uh, as we get inside there, you're gonna be amazed at how large it is. But nice, well kept front yard. Uh, from here, you get a little bit better view. Wonderful mountain views from the front. Like I said, we've got a beautiful large cul de sac, um, nice, mature landscaping, well kept homes. There's a separate deck, or patio I guess, here on the front. Nice big play area. And a Trex deck comes up on the front. So you don't have to worry about replacing this in a couple years. A nice little patio out here with great views overlooking the front. As we walk in, <coughs> you can notice home has been just extremely well kept. Could use a little updating, but is definitely move in ready. So as we walk in, off to the right, we've got this great big living area with beautiful big picture windows. So you get lots of natural light. It opens up to a formal dining room. Walks on through into the kitchen. As you said, he's a little updating, but for the right family, it is easily moving ready and just a wonderful, wonderful big home. It's almost 3,400 total square feet. And the kitchen opens up to a nice big backyard. It's been fenced for dog run or kids to keep it Closed in here, with the access gate that walks up to wonderful mature landscaping. So lots of wildlife and room to play for the kids. In here, got two patios. The lower deck there goes into the main living area with the big sliding glass door. And this one walks right into the kitchen and So from here, we also overlook, actually here, and step down into the main family area. The big, the big oversized sliding glass door, exit out to the back patio, large wood burning fireplace with beautiful built-ins, and plenty of room, natural light and a built-in wet bar there. It's gonna take us down to the patio or the basement. Got a full guest bath here. Large size bedroom, which is currently being used as an office. And nice oversized laundry area. Now this is a walk-in from the garage. Go ahead and open up the, as you see, it's a two car garage, but unbelievable space. Owner actually is able to hang a basketball hoop here, so you can see how much space there is if you want to put additional shelving or even a decking in here. I'm going to head on down to the basement now, which has been fully finished <coughs> into a nice game room with the additional bedroom and bath here. So you see it's a nice comfortable space. Does not have a walkout. It's got garden level windows, which make you really feel like you're not in a basement at all. But plenty of room for a full size pool table and couch. Walking, we got a really large bedroom. Down here. This is going to be some additional storage, just unfinished storage area. And 
separate bath. So actually I'm going to step back real quick so you can see how comfortable and well laid out this room is. So we head back up. We've got three more bedrooms upstairs. So we've got the opportunity. We do have a main level bathroom here, or bedroom. But then uh, the traditional master is upstairs. So we've got three up here, one in the main level, one in the basement. <coughs> Start out. The guest bath, we've got dual vanities. A nice large tub. Guest bedroom. One of the great things about the homes built in this era, the bedrooms are really good size. I'm gonna actually walk in so you can get a kind of a peek of the beautiful views too from the bedrooms. And into the master. So one of the things, aside from having really good space, we've got, although this isn't one of the newer traditional homes with huge master closets, we've got three. We've got one closet there, one closet there, then another one there. So there's plenty of room for everybody. Dual vanities, steps into the shower and toilet area. So we have one more quick walk down to the main level. Just a wonderful layout here. So you've got great kind of light everywhere. Big, beautiful picture window in the front. Um, so actually beautiful, you don't see very often, but real wood parquet floors, which refinish could be just unbelievable. Nice open space into the informal area. This is as well as the formal living. Back to the kitchen with tons of counter space. Walk out, and once again opens up into kind of the heart of the home, the living area.